What's happening in today's healthcare job market? We're about to show you. Advance presents Man on the Street interviews, featuring short clips of colleagues and experts answering employment questions at our job fairs held around the country. Watch and listen now to what they have to say. I would say, number one, be persistent. You know, just keep at it and everything, and be creative. Uh, maybe you have to think outside the box. Maybe you're thinking, oh, I want to go into med surge nursing, but you should broaden your scope a little bit, because there are lots of areas of nursing that you can get into. And just getting your foot into do the door one, one area and get some experience there, and who knows where it can lead to. I think the most important thing to do today is to realize that you have lots of skills that you probably don't recognize and to look outside the traditional role of nursing in a hospital. There are just so many things that nurses can do in industry and in unrelated pure health care environments that are overlooked by most nurses. I would say that the most important thing is to really get in touch with what you love about nursing and to find a situation in which you can practice that way, where you can do those activities, where you can really allow yourself to become the professional that you want to be. I would say that you should be very focused, you should research, and then you should work on those goals in terms of what the position requires, the qualifications, what department, any certifications, and also network. Find out the managers and then actually form relationships. Basically, I think the most important thing is to network, find your networks, and also um, expand in terms of um, your search, you know, from websites to um, maybe researching um, the actual facility you're applying for, researching the actual units so that you are the most marketable candidate. Making sure that you do all that, you know, that is probably the best advice I could give you. When you're conducting your job search, keep moving forward. Don't take rejections personally. Make a chart, make 10 contacts every week, follow up on your contacts, but always remember you must keep moving forward. All right, well my recommendation is, uh, first of all, it starts with a resume. That's definitely your first impression you're going to give to any company. Um, you're going to want to check for accuracy, professionalism on the resume, no spelling errors. It's got to be your best work, uh, your very first impression. Uh, next step, um, you're going to want to not only send your resume to the companies, but you're going to want to make sure that you uh, also follow up as well. Resumes do get lost in the resume databases and banks, and sometimes a phone call to an HR manager is all it takes to uh, get that interview. To network. Uh, know your facility. Go on their website. Find out what exactly that facility is about because when hospitals are interviewing you, you're also interviewing that hospital. You want to make sure it's a good fit as long as and it meets the goals that you, you are looking to achieve. If you're looking for a job, you need to stand out among the sea of scrubs. Keep watching our Man on the Street interviews for tips and advice from all regions of the nation. For more information on upcoming advanced job fairs, visit advanceweb.com slash jobfairs. For career strategies, check out advanceweb.com slash healthcarecareers. Good luck in your job search.